हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू आई सी यू नर्स यूट्यूब चैनल द स्टडी ऑफ बोन्स इज कॉल्ड ए ऑर्निथोलॉजी बी ओटोलॉजी सी ऑस्टियोलॉजी डी ऑफ्थेलमोलॉजी एंड द आंसर इज C. Osteology. The study of bones is called osteology. The disease of the bone in which there is reduced bone mineral density is known as A. Coffin-Lowry syndrome. B. Hypophosphatasia. C osteoporosis D arthritis and the answer is C osteoporosis The disease of the bone in which there is reduced bone mineral density is known as osteoporosis low bone mass and deterioration of bone tissue is seen in osteoporosis which will increase the risk of fracture osteoporosis develops over a number of years without showing any symptoms hence it is known as a silent thief which type of joint is found in knee and elbow A ball and socket joint B pivot joint C T joint D hinge joint and the answer is D hinge joint the type of joint found in knee and elbow is hinge joint Hinge joint is a common class of synovial joint. Examples of hinge joints are ankle, elbow and knee joint. Hinge joints are formed between two or more bones. In this type of joints, bones can only move along one axis to flex or extend and cannot move towards the other side. blood cells are formed in which part of the bone a ligament b joint c bone marrow d tendon and the answer is c bone marrow blood cells are formed in bone marrow of the bone metacarpal bones are found in a leg b skull c hip d hand and the answer is d hand metacarpal bones are found in the hands Which of the following is the longest bone in human body? A radius B tibia C ulna D femur And the answer is D femur Femur is the longest bone in the human body. The spinal cord of human body is protected by A carpals B femur 
C. Skull D. Vertebra And the answer is D. Vertebra The spinal cord of the human body is protected by vertebra. Spinal cord is made up of bundles of nerve fibers. These nerve fibers runs down from the brain through a canal in the center of the bones of the spine. These bones that is the vertebrae protects the spinal cord. The heart and the lungs are protected by A. Skull B. Ribs and sternum C. Humerus D. Radius and ulna And the answer is B. Ribs and sternum The heart and lungs are protected by ribs and sternum. The division of skeleton which is composed of pelvic girdle, pectoral girdle and bones of upper and lower limbs is known as A. Axial skeleton B. Appendicular skeleton C. Perpendicular skeleton D. Both A and B And the answer is B. Appendicular skeleton The division of skeleton which is composed of pelvic girdle, pectoral girdle and bones of upper and lower limbs is known as appendicular skeleton. The appendicular skeleton is the portion of skeleton that supports the limbs. Appendicular skeleton makes the movement of human body possible. The bone to muscle connection is called A. Ligament B. Girdle C. Limbs D. Tendons and the answer is D. Tendons The bone to muscle connection is called tendons. A tendon attaches muscle to bone. They help to move the bone or structure and also helps in withstanding tension. The method used by anthropologists to determine the gender of unidentified human skeleton is known as A. Eminence method B. Canine method C. Phenice method D. Supraorbital method And the answer is C. Phenice method Phenice method is the method used by anthropologists to determine the gender of an unidentified human skeleton. Phenice method is a form of gross morphological analysis used to determine the sex of an unidentified human skeleton based on three characteristics of the pelvis. The ventral arc subpubic concavity and the medial aspect of the ischiopubic ramus. The total number of bones in the adulthood are A. 206 bones B. 220 bones C. 212 bones D. 217 bones and the answer is 